The Osu Osfor Street, as late as 1 a.m., was jammed with vehicular traffic. So this is the Dankwa Circle, and if you know this roundabout, you know that it connects motorists from the Kwame Nkrumah Circle to the Labadi Road. Also, if you're going to um, Usu, this is where you would use, that is on the right side. And if you're going to Cantonments too, you would use this particular roundabout. And on a normal day, you would have spent like five minutes uh, or less um, to move up, up around this this particular circle but currently as i speak to you there's a great lock on my right side you know or you can see these um, cars all moving towards the osfo street and you can see that it's taking longer time for them to even proceed because of the increased um cars or motorists in town and f per our own assessment we understand that this is because of um, persons coming to town to celebrate their Christmas festivities. The usual busy street was buzzing with events from one pub to another. From the Plus 233, Corner Pub and Grill to Purple Pub, people had gathered to celebrate the festive season. <laughs> According to some revelers who had come to wine and dine, they say the year 2020 has been a tough one. It has been tough because I work at East City, so I interact with people and it hasn't been easy. Sometimes when you are going to work, you get scared that somebody is going to threat you or something. But we still go on with this and we have come this far. So I'm so excited, I couldn't just sit home and just sleep. I have to come and have fun. Because we started a year with a lot of people, but not all that has with us now. So it's excitement for me this evening. This is very special. Back home, we, we're on lockdown. Corona there is too much. Here, there's no Corona. So I think this Christmas has been great for me, especially. If I was back home, it wouldn't be this as much as fun as this. So I'm very grateful for this opportunity. It's, it's been rough mentally because people are leaving left and right, left and right. Some people you don't see. Some people, you know, they go to heaven and there's no one around them to see them go. Um, it's been rough. So I was trying to go ahead and come here with my family so that we can, through the roughness, we can see that there's still joy in the world. We can see that there's still, you know, family, there's still tradition, there's still culture, there's still Ghana. We can come to and enjoy as well. Meanwhile, many revelers are hopeful that 2021 will come with good fortunes. In 2021, I'm hoping to see that this COVID or whatever, where it came from, will go back and life will come to normal and everything will be okay because this COVID is really disturbing us. It is really disturbing us. I'm praying that you should go. And 2021 should be a fantastic year as we are entering. We pray to God. What I'm expecting 2021 is not to hear anything about COVID-19 anymore. I wish my mother, my, fa my father, my, my daughter, Adepa, I wish them good health. Because this year has been hurt. So next year, no death in my family, no sickness. And I wish all my friends very well next year. For Ghanaian hip life artists, Ochiame Kwame, who was holding a program at the Plus 233, he is confident that 2021 will not disappoint. Well, next year is going to be fun filled, God willing, if we don't get another uh, pandemic. <laughs> you know, so because of what happened, I don't want to give too many promises, but next year will be fun. So have fun, go and enjoy the show. Okay. Finally, your last messages to family and friends. So I say, the new year promises to be amazing, enjoy it. There are varying opinions uh, with regard to how this Christmas festivity is going. Here on the Oddford Street, some people I've spoken to have indicated to me that they are going to enjoy themselves whether um, there is COVID or not. For others, they feel that they need to stay at home and prevent uh, the spread of the coronavirus. Here on the Oddford Street, my name is Kweku Ediyama Ansa reporting for City News.